Whether it's data or in any other data analysis software, one of the first things you should learn is where to look for help. In Stata, you can either use the command help or the command search, followed by the command or task you want to know more about. Choosing between these two will depend on whether you know or not the exact name of the command you are looking for. So I'm going to give you a couple examples. Suppose you want to learn more about how to summarize data, but you don't know the exact name of the commands that do that. In this case, you should use the command search, followed by the task, which is summarize data, because you don't know the name of the command that does that, and you press enter. So this is going to open a new window, which is called the viewer. Right here, you can see it. And you just did a search for summarized data, everything that Stata can find that relates to summarized data. And here you can have a list of commands, miss table, pk sum, summarize. And on the right hand side, you have a short description of each command. For example, we have inspect, which is a command. Here is a short description of this command. So it displays simple summary of data's attributes. And here in the bottom, you have the help for this command. Note there's some text here in blue. So you can see inspect, tabulate, summarize, and these are just hyperlinks, which you can click. And this is going to take you directly to the documentation that you need to know. Also in the view window, you should know it's just like a browser. Here you have a back arrow. You can just go back to where you searched if you want to look at other commands but we don't, so let's just go forward and take a look at inspect. So note that now you have here, help inspect. So this is the window we would see if we use the help command. Let's give it a try. Just close this window now, and in the command window, we type help inspect to see that the exact same window comes up. So in my opinion, using the help command is the easiest way to search for help once you're already acquainted with Stata, and it's one of the commands that I use the most in my work. Now let's understand this documentation here. First, you have the title, which is inspect, short description, and then you have the command syntax. That is the rules for constructing the command in a way that Stata will be able to interpret, and which we're gonna talk more about in another video. So the syntax for inspect is inspect, or note here you have an underscore. So this text, INS, means that you can either use the command inspect or INS, and it's gonna work anyway. And here you have some options, var list, if, and in. And we're gonna talk about all these options further in this course. So I strongly suggest you pause the video now, or go back to the documentation sometime soon, and skim through it, because this is something that will be very useful to you as you become more and more proficient in using Stata. Here in this case, the documentation is quite simple. It's not very long. You don't have a lot of things to learn about because it is a simple command. Since there are several options here in this command, you can jump straight to the information you want by using the find option, which is this option over here, and just typing whatever you want. Here, on the bottom, I mean. So I just type, uh, let's say you want to learn examples. You press enter. And here you go, see highlighted in blue, you have some examples. You can also reach find by typing control F if you're in Windows or the command key and F if you are on a Mac. Another useful part of a command help file is the quick access toolbar, which is there, this bar right here on the top right hand side. And you have three options here. The first one is dialogue, it's going to show you a link to any dialogues associated with this command. Here it will open the dialog for the command inspect, while the second one is called also see, showing you links for the documentation of some related commands and is a good way to explore some new commands actually. So you can see that the commands codebook, compare, describe, and so on, summarize, these are all commands that have something to do with the command inspect. They're mostly descriptive stats commands. And then the last option here is the jump to. So if you use the jump to, you can just skip and go straight to any of the options that you see here. So let's say we want to go to stored results. We just click here and it's going to take us to the store results section within the same window over here. 
As you can see, help and search are extremely useful commands if you get stuck or want to learn more about any specific command, including themselves. So why don't you try running the commands help help or help search to see what I mean and learn some more about them. For now, don't worry about understanding everything, just keep moving on.